Hi, this is Mark Minson with Mathnasium of Draper, Utah. Today we're going to learn how to use a subtraction chart to help you with your subtraction facts, just like a multiplication chart. It's basically a 10 by 10 grid, and we have up in the corner here 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And down the same side, we have the same thing, 1 through 10. All right, now, if we make these into rows and columns, you're familiar with a addition chart. We're just going to change this to subtraction and use our column as our base. We're going to say 1 minus 1 is 0. We're going to say 2 minus 1 is 1. We could go further out and say, what is 7 minus 5? And that's going to give us a 2 right here. You'll notice that if you do 2 minus 2, you get 0. If you do 3 minus 3, you get 0. If you do 4 minus 4, you get 0. So we're going to have zeros on the diagonal all the way down to here to 10 minus 10 is 0 again. And simply fill in as you go. Now, what if we're going to subtract a larger number from a smaller number? And what if we're going to do 3 minus 5? Well, we take away 3 from 5, and we have 2 left, and those take us into the minus. So we're going to have a minus 2 over here on 3 minus 5. So I bet you can now figure out that we're going to have all minuses on this half of the table, and we're going to have all pluses on this half of the table. So 10 minus 1 is 9, 10 minus 2 is 8, and so on down this way. So this half will be all pluses, this side will be all minuses, and that's how we're going to create a subtraction table. Thanks for watching. This has been Mark Minson with Mathnasium of Draper, Utah.